Public officials, police officers, friends, and family fell to Queens Church Saturday to remember Rafael Ramos, one of the two NYPD officers killed last week. Both Vice President Joe Biden and New York City Mayor Bill de Blasio spoke at the ceremony. I'm sure I speak for the whole nation. It's the one I say to you that, uh, that uh, our hearts ache for you. Our hearts are aching today. We feel it physically. We feel it deeply. New York City has lost a hero. 730 police officers from around the nation that were flown in by JetBlue were also in attendance. The funeral came a day after an equally packed wake that lasted eight hours. Because of the crowds, the event had to be projected on a screen to onlookers outside. My father was a man of character. He was a selfless man. Ed, I'm forever grateful for the sacrifices he made to provide for me and Jaden. Ramos and his partner were shot to death December 20th while sitting in their patrol car. Police say the gunman, Ismail Brinsley, also shot and injured his ex-girlfriend earlier that day. Ramos was studying to become a pastor, and those who knew him said the officer viewed his work as a ministry. Ramos leaves behind a wife and two children. Funeral plans for Ramos's partner, Winjin Liu, have not yet been announced. For Newsy, I'm Madison Burke.